Everything was good, especially the landing. Yes! In that movie Grind last night, there's I a- I gotta go. There's a- <laughs> I just put up to El Sereno right now, meeting up with Dan. It's so nice. It's, it's autumn, autumn day up here. I had to think because the seasons are backwards, but it's autumn up here. Temperature's like 23 degrees. Very cool, there's a breeze. Uh, last time I tried to come and skate, El Sereno was with Luke when he was up here and it was too hot. Like it was like we were melting. So yeah, keen to get some skating done. I got some uh, brunch or breakfast or whatever. Life is good. I told a girl last night that I loved her and she told me that she loved me back. I'm going in the back way to the park. I usually go that way, but I'm going through the bush. I don't know if I told you guys in the last vid, but my ankle's feeling way better. It almost feels like it never happened. So super, super grateful for that. Um, there's a couple of tricks I want to learn today. I want to try to get a kicky front board. Maybe Dan can coach me through that. And uh, maybe a blunt on one of the out rails. So evidently, I had no idea Dan's eyes were blue. You didn't know that I was a babe. <laughs> You know why? Because you're always looking at my, my teeth. I don't know. <laughs> and you're like, you don't even consider from here up. I didn't. I don't know what it is. I think it's... If this was all you knew... It's the like, yellow that brings it out of your eyes. I, I think, think it's the blue of my eyes that brings out the blue of my eyes, Sean. <laughs> How long have we been friends? We've been friends like over a year and it's skated heaps. And I, I can remember. This is the first time I've noticed you. We've been friends for like Piercing blue eyes. Yeah, it's yeah, about here, two pretty years. Much. Yeah, pretty much two years. I changed my board size. What board size are you riding? Eight now. Really? Yeah, like Why? What's the, the what's the... I'm, I'm doing my own board shape now, and so I'm trying to find like the best of all the worlds that I like. Okay. So I'm going to skate this 8.5 for a little while, figure out what I like about this, because I already know what I really like about 8.75. Yeah. And maybe try to find some sort of medium between. Oh, because you're going to get your own little... Yeah, I'm doing oh, my own board shape. Mm. Um, yeah, that's, that's it. So. I'm always 8.38, 8.5 type of guy. Yeah, I'm thinking 8.68 eight is what I want. Really? It's the same as my height. It's a very... <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. You're gonna show me your tray? I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you my tray. Oh and yeah. Then you can tell me what I'm doing wrong. Okay. But when I was a kid, I was like a really big flat ground skater. Here we go. No, no seriously, <laughs> because the park we had was sucked and it just had flat ground in the middle. So I'd skate to the park, skate flat ground, and just go home. So ask anyone from my old, old local that I was ripping the flat ground back in the day. See, I had a Walmart parking lot across my from my Jeez. house. So I would go, well, that was later in life. Growing up, I had my backyard, which was yeah. really shitty concrete. Uh -huh. But then when we moved to uh, Hanover, there's a re decent black top, okay. like decent flat ground. So I just get a flat ground all the time. Yeah, yeah, flat ground kinks. That was good. Well, if you pop closer to the middle, the higher it goes, the more in the pocket, the faster it spins. Like that's how you get it higher. I put mine in the pocket when I'm warming up and then the more comfortable I get, the more uh, farther back on the tail I put it. Really? Yeah. <laughs> Everything was good, especially the landing. It's all like my jump in the air. It's hard to like control like that trick going in the air and adjusting it accordingly. Not an easy one to get used to. I used to have them like, now I'm old and washed up. Please. You're literally not old. You're not even 30 yet, are you? I'm 24. You're 24? Are you really? Yeah. No, you're not. Yeah. No commitment. You got it. I traded a five stair back in Oz. Did you? A few years ago. Yeah. When you were 19? Yeah. <laughs> a few years ago? I really am surprised that you're 24. I didn't know that we were the same age. Three, to the three, to the three. Oh, you big pop that. You okay? Yeah, that was it. You don't have to do the three if you don't want to. I just want you to try one. Let's do one and then let's do other things. So I wasn't planning on this. Well, well, I don't care what you were planning on. This is my video. Hi, Jack. <laughs> what, uh, what are you going to do now? You should do cameos. You did the app. Hey, Jordan, happy birthday. Uh, happy you have a good one, mate. People pay you to do that. I randomly do those anyways. Like, I've had like five different girls hit me up and be like, hey, my boyfriend like watches your videos. Really? Could you wish him a happy birthday? You have to. You have to... I do it for free. That takes like two seconds. Because he's a good bloke. He's such a good bloke. All right. Trade the, the three set. Massive three set. Oh, you had it though. Okay, what did you want to do today, Sean? I wanted to do some stuff. Since you clearly don't want to do what I want to do. the rail first, because it's always fun. Okay, let's play the rail feeble, first. Feeble, maybe 50, and then some other shit. Okay. If you feeble, you have to pop before that crack. What do you mean? 
Did you see this crack here? You have to pop before that. It's also sticky. Yeah. <laughs> I pulled it out. That was kind of cool. You like 180'd like out kind of early. Was I? But like a millisecond from the end. Damn. Oh shit, right. I'm gonna try sticky on this thing. Maybe front. Okay. So Before the crack front. is the rule. Yeah? Yeah. Literally the main thing I like about this rail is because of that crack. Like it's uncomfortable to pop like out of the crack. So either you're tapping or getting on the whole thing. So it kind of forces you to try to slide the whole thing. It either encourages or discourages being a kook. Heel side. Oh, dirty. Sometimes you're just heel side guy. You were trying, but you didn't. I went heel side. Yeah, it was heel side. You didn't know that you went heel side? I always try to think front Smith and just like. Then I guess if it runs into my heel, then it's alright too. Yeah, like as long as you land it. You didn't go off the end, so that doesn't count. Okay, one more? Yep. Oh, cunt! You're going faster, that was good. Yeah, scary fast, You looked a little bit more comfortable that time, actually. Even yeah? though it went haywire. Yeah, you looked a little bit less scared. Okay. Oh, I looked a little bit. <laughs> yeah, I can see it in your eye. <laughs> there you go. Front thieves. Front thieves? Yeah. Okay. I'll try to get on like in the middle. I thought you were going to try back fifth. Yeah. Front thieves is cool. Do front thieves. Oh, you've been doing that trick lately, huh? I have been trying to. Yeah, it looks like you got it. It worked. Hell yeah. I watched this movie last night. I haven't watched it in a long up. time. Called Grind. No. It's, it's from 2003. It's a movie movie. It's not a skate movie, but it's about skateboarding. But Dan hates it. Why? Tell me why he didn't like Grind. Well, I think it came out in a time when I was like starting to get like really into skateboarding. I think I had just got my first skate shop sponsor and seeing like a Hollywood rem like rendition of what they think skateboarding is was just so goddamn cringy like they're like, like it was like so like oh like it's about like so it was you know what it was what it was the plot of brink done with skateboarding oh, shit. done way worse it was brink skateboarding Brinkin? worse yeah brink's way better but it's all about like soul skating and like yeah you know doing it for you but like dude i was young when that movie came out so i was like oh wow well, like like they they make skateboarding look sick yeah and as cheesy as it was back then like it's aged pretty well <laughs> Watch it. Sweet Lou, the fucking... Yeah, it's that, that guy really has good. creepy vibes. You reckon? Oh, yeah, he's, he'd be cancelled. He would be cancelled. Sweet Lou. Dude, if you guys haven't watched Grind, go and watch it. No! It's free on YouTube with ads. Type in Grind, it'll pop up. It's free with ads. Check it out. Tell me if you think it's a good movie, because Dan, he's a movie connoisseur, apparently. Skate movie connoisseur. You watch Gleaming the Cube? Yeah. What did you think of that? That's fun. That's a fun watch. Okay. Yeah. But you not know, Grind. You know what you guys should also check out? What? Not watching Grind. <laughs> This is, a weird, this is a weird session for me. Come to do no slides. Legs. Yeah, yeah I want to do my legs too. I want to do some no slides yeah, on there. this ledge over there because that was the first trick I learned when I was a kid was uh, no slide on curb. Yeah, out the front of my house. Yeah, yeah, get a nice long one. I should have grabbed wax when I was in my car. Yeah, it's I blew pretty it. slippery. It should go. Okay. <laughs> what the fuck happened there? You're straight in it. You got to bend your knees. If you straight leg it, it's, it's, yeah, it just makes you stick. You gotta bend your knees. Okay. There it was. I felt good. Looked good. It felt powerful. It felt powerful. That's what I felt. I wanna K it now. Yeah, K it. So bump to K is like, I always struggle to get my tail up because I'm always like, what do you call it? Because you're already coming from more of an angle like this, yeah. so you have that much more to correct. You have to go up. Yeah, have long limbs, eh? Oh, yeah. Oh, that was good. Did I pass the crack? You definitely passed the crack. Yeah, can you? Okay, you want to kill from board the flat bar. The bump the rail. Yeah, I mean, I feel like it'd be out of the bump, wouldn't it? Yeah, yeah. So he's going to hail Mary. Are you going to just go for it? <laughs> That's a backside flip. So, yeah, you That's got it. Way, isn't it? I think kickflip front board is nothing like backside flip. It's everything like kickflip. Like you kickflip front board. You don't backside flip at the rail. Different flicks. 
I think if you treated it like a backside flip, you could clip the rail on the way up. I would kick flip diagonally at it, and then when I catch it, just give it a little. Does that make sense? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that's scary. That is scary. Holy shit. But the rail's short enough, I feel like, feel like you'll get in and get out. I think you're gonna be fine. Yeah, I just have to get the kickflip though. It's intimidating kick flipping towards it. I say just Hail Mary, like you said. Just go yeah. for it no matter what. I know I have kickflips, I just have to fucking. I think you're gonna do it. Turn it up. I think today's. And I already said I wanted to try it when I was walking in today. So oh, nice. Yeah, it turn out. up, dude. Turn it up, dude. Turn up. You're gonna turn up out here. You are a vegan, you love turn ups. What's a turn up? Turn it. Is that what you mean? Is that a food? Turn up. They're, they're pronounced turn. Uh -huh. Then there's a space, and then there's the word up. What is it? I have no idea. All right. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, you're gonna do that today for sure. That was so? that was it. Yes. Just get out of it now. Just kick I turn feel out. So heavy though. No, you're fine. Just land it. Just only think about the landing now. The rest is perfect. Yeah. Hell yeah. It that feels very stompy though. No, that's what you want. I feel like it's meant to feel like light and delicate. No, just land it. There. There it fucking was. Just turn out. You got this. You've literally got into like eight in a row. Just turn out. Yeah. It's because my weight is incorrect. It's, I don't know. It's like you're learning your body, how your body's going to feel in that trick. Your nipple is right here. Nope. Here. here. Yeah. It's getting cold. My nipple's getting hot. <laughs> He said odd. My toe touched the fucking ground. Yeah, but you did kick the front board for the first time. Yeah, that was sick. I liked it. I mean, do it again, but I liked it. Do it one more time. That's yeah. That's the speed, I think. Yeah, that was perfect. Can I see it? No. I get these comments every now and then, and people are like, Sean, you can skate. I don't know why you don't try to skate with a bit more conviction and aggression and intention. I don't. I'm very like fairy, like light on my feet when I skate. Almost timid. I feel like I'm a very timid skateboarder, which is all right. But I want to be able to like look good at skating. So it's like I have to like be a bit more aggressive. Aggressive. I can't remember who commented it, but yeah. It was me. Was Get your shit together. <laughs> that was really structured. You're stoked. I am stoked. You know what? Uh, Seven Ferraris. Do you know what inspired me to do the kickflip front board today? You're gonna laugh. Nine Ferraris. <laughs> Nine Ferraris. What inspired you to do the kickflip front board? In that movie Grind last night. There's I a, gotta go. There's a. <laughs> there's no, a there is no. Okay. <laughs> listen, me, dude. Okay, I'm listening. There's a 13 year old Ryan Checkler, and he did a kickflip front board on a on down a flat bar. There's only one thing you need to take away from the grind movie. What? Right. Chad Fernandez. Yes, a that's that dude's name? I forgot his name. Chad Fernandez, a legitimate pro skateboarder, first person to do Crook Down Hollywood 16. Has done a lot of gnarly tricks. In that movie, He's as a, a professional skater. skateboarder, they needed a stunt double for him to do any trick he did in the movie because he only skates vert in that movie. He doesn't skate. So he's a street skater. He is a professional level street skater who needed a fucking stunt double. Who was a stunt double? Uh, I want to say Matt, Mathis Ringstorm, however you say his okay. name. Okay. Another skater. So that's a, that's a fun fact about the movie Grind, guys. So go and check it out after no! you watch this video. <laughs> Don't check it out. You're not, I, you know what you should say? Check it out, click this link. What? And then they click the link and it just takes them to my channel. <laughs> Still 20% off at eveningmob.com. Go and pick something up. you get some stickers if you're lucky. Now I'll throw in some stickers. Just go buy something. Uh, yeah. Cheers for watching the video. Stoked on that kicky front board. Uh, <laughs> I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say in my outro. Subscribe if you're new. That's about it. Uh, go buy something. <laughs> on your way back, bring me his son.